Welcome to Velo Pro. My name is Bob, and I want to talk about amino acids. We talked about proteins and protein mixes in the past, established 50 grams as a baseline for most people, and weightlifters and endurance athletes probably require more. So, what I have here are two types of whey mixes. Now, I gave up on the vegetarian mix because I don't need it, and it lacks the amino acids I want. But so does this whey mix, but it's a good supplement if you're not a weightlifter. In other words, some people don't really want a bunch of amino acids and really just want to add a little protein and this is the ticket. So that's a fine way to go and the veggie uh, will work equally well and I did try a can of it and I liked it. It was, it was okay. But what we have here is a Weiler uh, and this is more of a bodybuilder formulation. And I'm just going to cover it real quick because I don't want to go through every amino. But the ones that I'm going to talk about help us. And that's alanine, which enhances performance and increases capacity while lowering fatigue. L-valine, which is uh, great for bodybuilding and tissue recovery. L-crystalline, which is a protein uh, for bodybuilding and helps you build new protein. l aspartic helps fatigue and cellular energy. L-glycine, which is good for uh, uh, building uh, protein. And L-lysine, which promotes calorie burning and weight loss. L-proline helps joints, tendons, hearts, and muscles. L-tryptophan uh, converts to serotonin in the body, which is great for helpful rest, for rest and sleep and mood. L-valine uh, helps bodybuilding and, uh, oh, I already said that one, and uh, tissue recovery. Right, so that pretty much wraps it up on aminos. And this is the one that I'm going to be using in the morning and in the evening on training days. On off days, I will simply use the one without aminos. Also, we're going to incorporate a recovery drink, and this is loaded with aminos, but most importantly, electrolytes. And we talked about electrolytes, and it has other goodies in it, and I'll leave a link for this recovery mix. Because I think a sports recovery drink in the summer isn't that bad. It isn't always going to be possible to create your perfect cocktail when you're traveling. It may not be possible. This could be a very reasonable alternative. And I will be taking, when I do travel, and we will be traveling, my oats. Because I do like my oats for breakfast. Not every day, but with a little maple syrup and raisins, maybe a sprinkle of walnuts. And for dessert, now this is Spanish arroz con leche. It's rice pudding and milk. It's a rice pudding and, and milk. Oh my gosh, this stuff is so good. It's cold, so I have to eat it really soon. But I'm gonna get to my rice pudding for my dessert today. It's really a wonderful Spanish thing, and you put a little cinnamon, oh, it's the best. So we're gonna get to that, and I thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell. Gotta run.